Scientific evidence provides clear proof that current levels of wireless radiation endanger public health and the environment. In our paper released today, we have documented that environmental levels of exposure to wireless radiation have increased exponentially even in the past decade. Cell phones, Wi-Fi routers, AirPods, Bluetooth, smart speakers, an increasing array of devices in 4G and 5G all emit RF microwave radiation, a new form of environmental pollution. Health and safety standards were only set to avoid heating and don't take into account the growing evidence of damage at levels that do not produce heat. Peer-reviewed studies have been conducted all over the world that show that microwave radiation at very low levels can damage DNA, can increase the risk of cancer, as well as damage the sperm, effects on memory, hearing, the nervous system, and endocrine system effects. Psychiatrists have identified recently technoference as a real and growing problem with technology undermining basic parental and family life. Regarding this radiation, children are much more vulnerable due to their thinner skulls, their brains containing more fluid, and their faster growing bodies. And yet the Federal Communications Commission and other international groups that set limits do not protect children nor set standards for medically vulnerable populations or wildlife. The US, Canada, and Australia have limits for microwave radiation exposure that are 10 to 100 times higher than those of numerous other high-tech countries, such as Switzerland and Italy and others. Therefore, it is urgent that governments worldwide take measures to protect the public and the environment by reducing exposures to wireless radiation to as low as reasonably achievable.